This will be the solution video of 2024, Samsung 2, paper 1, ASL question 9. It's like the last question of SL. Uh, this is also actual question 10, which is like the first question of section B. So, uh, it's quite an interesting question. So given an arithmetic sequence, so this trick has come out multiple time, uh, even in SL by now. If a sequence is arithmetic, then there is a common difference. You can find common difference by second term minus the first term. But you can also find common difference by the third term minus the second term. But they should be common, so they should be the same. So you can add the P to the other side, so 2P minus a is q, so 2p is q plus a. Uh, oh, they want 2p minus q, so 2p minus q is a, okay? And similarly, you can do the same thing for geometric. If it's geometric, there is a common ratio. Common ratio is second term over the first term, which is also the third term over the second term. Then you cross multiply. So s squared is a times t. Then what? Both sequence have the same first term, which is a. You're also given that both q and t are one. Mm, interesting. So, so p is bigger than half. So you uh, you're kind of trying to find p. Yeah, you try uh, kind of trying to find p. So from part a, what do we have? We have a being two p minus q, but q is one now, so one. Then I guess we can substitute this into part b. So s squared is two p minus one times t, but t is also one, so times one, which is nothing. So two p must be s squared plus one, right? You can add this one to the left and then dividing by two. So P is s squared over two plus one over two, right? You divide each of them by two. But you see S is not zero. So there is, it says S is not zero. But even if s is negative, when you square it, it will become positive. So, so since s is not zero, s square is bigger than zero. Therefore, p is something bigger than zero plus half. So p must be bigger than half. Okay. So that's why now we know that a is nine and q and t are still one. Oh, and s is bigger than zero now. Find the first four terms of each of the sequence. So I think it, it basically means find p and s. Uh, so what do we know? Again, we know this. a is 2p minus 1, but now a is 9. So 9 is 2p minus 1. So 10 would be 2p, so p is 5. Once you know p, if you go to here, s squared plus 1 is 2p, which is 10. So s squared is 9. So s is plus minus 3, but so s is bigger than 0, so s is 3. So the arithmetic sequence, so the arithmetic sequence was a, p, and then q. We'll say a is 9, p is 5, q is 1. One. They want the first four terms, so we find the next term. So the common difference is obviously minus four. So next is minus three. And then geometric sequence. Uh, the terms are a and then s and then t. So a is nine. S is three. T is one. So the common ratio would be times one third, right? Because they're dividing by three, so it's times one third. One times one third is one third. So that's the first four terms. 
Uh, so now what? We have a new arithmetic sequence, un. The first three terms of un is 9 plus ln 9, 5 plus ln 3, and 1 plus ln 1. Find the common difference. So again, uh, it's just second term minus first term. You could also do the third term minus the second term. It would be the same. So it's 5 plus ln 3 minus 9 plus ln 9. Minus 9 minus ln 9. 5 minus 9 is minus 4. Ln3 minus Ln9 by the property of log is Ln3 over 9. 3 over 9 is 1 third. Uh, but they want it to be in terms of Ln3. 1 third is 3 to the power of negative 1. So you can drop the negative 1. So the sum. Uh, is arithmetic, right? So this is the summation of the term from the first term to the tenth term. So that's S10. So we can use the summation formula, which is n over 2, n being 10 now, 2 times u1 plus n minus 1d. Again, n is 9, uh, n is 10. So 10 over 2 is 5. 2 times of u1, u1 plus 9 times d, d is what we just found. Uh, I guess we will simplify the inside first. So 18 plus 2 L and 9 minus 36 minus 9 root 3. So we've got 18 minus 36, so that's minus 36. Uh, 9. 9 is 3 squared. So if we if we drop the power becomes 2 times 2, so it's 4. Four minus nine is negative three. Then you uh, multiply with 5 in. 5 times 18 is 90. 25 which is what they have. 